welcome back. Today I'm going to share with you a eyeglasses cleaner so that you can make it home with a few natural ingredients that you may already have in the kitchen with you. Now I've let my glasses get super, super, super dirty just to show you the difference of when they are clean. So I don't know if you guys can tell with all the glare, but they're like super schmoggy. There you go. So I've let them get really, really cloudy with all like gunk and stuff on them. As they usually build up over time, but you tend to wash them with a cloth or something before they get like this. But I wanted to show you guys the difference of what they would look like after using this spray. So let's get into it. So all you're gonna need are three different ingredients. So I'll take these off because they're gonna look super glary when I for you. So you're going to need dishwashing liquid, about one to two drops of that. I'm just going to use this one we have at home. If you guys have a more natural one or a different one, you can use that. And then you're going to need equal parts of rubbing alcohol and good old water. So I'm going to measure my parts in teaspoons today because I only have a small little spray bottle with me. I've used all my other spray bottles that are bigger on other products that I've made. So this is the last remaining one, so I'm going to just use this little spray bottle today. So I'm going to use teaspoons, but if you guys have a bigger bottle that you want to use, you can use tablespoons or cups or whatever you like. So I'm going to be measuring in parts today, and those parts will be teaspoons. So I'm going to use... Oh, where is it? So I'm going to use three teaspoons of rubbing alcohol and three teaspoons of water. And then I'm going to use one drop of liquid dishwashing soap. I'm going to put that into my trusty little bowl just here and mix that up. So swell it together, pour it into my little spray bottle which will be a bit of a feat considering how tiny the little lid to putting it in is. So I'm going to have to funnel it through with a little funnel that I have. Pour that into there and then spray it on to my glasses just here. Now these aren't actually reading glasses because I'm quite blessed with good vision so I'm very happy about that. How these are just blue light blocking glasses. So I use them when I work on my computer or my phone just to help reduce the amount of blue light that is being absorbed in my eyes. Essentially to help in like to stop my eyes deteriorating over time through staring at screens all the time. Just helps with that and I also find it's really great at night when I'm working on my computer. It doesn't keep me alert and awake as much as I would without these because they help reduce that light. So yeah, if you guys want to know where I got these from, these are black, uh, black stuff. These are Baxter blue blue light blocking glasses and I will link them in the description below if you want to check them out. I also like the style of them, I find them very pretty. Anywho, moving on to the recipe. So we have our little spritz in here to use. So I'm going to simply spray it on to my glasses just here. Give it a few sprays on both sides. Then use a microfiber cloth or cotton cloth that you have at home. And you just wipe it away with that. And then voila, you have nice clean sunglasses, glasses, eyeglasses, all those. I can actually see out of them again which is fantastic because that's been something I've been struggling to do for a while I've been waiting to do this video so that is exactly how you make your own homemade DIY sunglasses eyeglasses cleaner so if you guys like this video if you did like it please give it a thumbs up and if you have any more tips or suggestions on other eyeglasses cleaners you guys have made yourself 
please feel free to share them in the comments below. I'd love to hear about them. Today's comment of the day goes to Nancy Plants. Thank you so much for sharing a lovely comment on my turmeric hair video and for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you all for watching and sticking out this whole video with me. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Feel free to check out more videos like this of mine in the future by just checking out the playlist next to me. It shows other DIYs that I've made in the past that you guys might be interested in. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching and if you want to, subscribe down below in the corner and make sure to hit that bell button next to it to keep up to date with future videos of mine. Hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!